Yo, what up? It's your boy, Genic 101. I have better things to do, but it's Fallout time. I beat Yakuza 3 last night. That video is going to come out on 7-7. Seven, seven. And now I just have to... I could rush, literally rush through the end of this game, but I want to continue doing what I was doing. We're not going to skimp. Alright. Still got a lot of game to play. A lot of places to discover. A lot of levels to get. Why I sold my mother. Alright. I love more than getting these boots wet. Well, then this is the perfect place for you, Kate. If we don't move fast, we can start going. Kate, I have enough rat away for everyone. Alright. I don't know what the hell was it. Really, leg, really. around everywhere, but I guess there was a war. How'd you find me with whatever's on your head? See what's going on over here. Swim warning. I'm gonna go to this radio tower. Oh man, I am a tired boy who needs to start doing things. Relay Tower 1DL-109. Stress beacon found. Oh no. This has been a pre recorded message. Message repeats in three seconds. Who's working here? 
here though. Thomas is hurt and needs. Oh no! It got the door open! Run, Thomas! Get out! I don't know we want to find this that distress get the signal. Message. message repeats in three seconds. If anyone can hear this, my son and I are trapped and need help. We were being what? chased by. Who's there? Very unprofessional of you. Run, Thomas, get out! This has been a pre recorded message. Message repeats in three seconds. Whatever, I can't exactly find that, but okay. Where's the vault? Thomas, get out! Yo, what up, Yagwai? Bye, Yagwai. Vault 81, what experiments happened here? I know that people still call home. Kind of weird that they still want to stay out here all by themselves. Hold it right there. Vault 81 security. I don't know where you got your hands on a working pit boy, but you better start talking. I got it in Vault 111. Vault 111? Haven't heard of that one yet. And what sort of business are you looking to take care of here in 81? I'm just a traveler. I thought I'd take a look around. Is that so? And you expect me to believe that? Oh, Overseer. Who is it, Edwards? Ma'am. Some new Commonwealth traveler. Not one of our usual traders. Well, if someone wants in, they can earn it like everyone else. Let me speak to them. Sorry about that. Officer Edwards here was just doing his job. I'm sure you can understand our need for caution. For newcomers, we like to operate on exchange. You help us, we help you. I'm interested. What is it you need? Fusion cores. Three, to be exact. Three fusion cores? You get the fusion cores. We grant the access. Oh no, I don't know if I can spare three. I already have the fusion cores you need. Really? Well then, I suppose I should say welcome. I'll be down to meet you at the entrance. Start at Vault 81. Let me in, people. Everyone's working hard right now, Cal. You think I don't know that? 
Just the do the work best with never what you ends can. Involving That's all I'm asking. Fine, I'll see what I can do. But you and I both know we can't keep going on like this. Sorry about that. Excuse me, where do you think you're going? Wherever I want. Excuse me, Overseer. Ready to talk now? Here, we pride ourselves on having maintained a successful vault over these past two centuries. We'd like to be completely self-sufficient. But there are certain resources we can't provide ourselves. <sighs> I'm impressed you maintained a successful vault for this long. Thanks. I owe it to the overseers before me, but some here would disagree. A few believe opening the doors to the Commonwealth was a mistake. The sound. You should be open-minded about the Commonwealth. It has its dangers, but it's got a lot to offer. It's the dangers that concern me. That's why I like to use a give-and-take system. If outsiders are the same to haircut, us, we're willing to help them. Speaking of, if you're ready, I can take those fusion cores from you. Of course. Here they are. Thank you. Dr. Penske will greatly appreciate these. Now, I have work to do. If you need anything else, I'll be in my office. Don't go feeling all special because the Overseer lets you in here. You weren't the first, and certainly won't be the last. You worry. I will annihilate this entire vault at, at any point. Your pit boy ever act up on you? Mine's been glitchy lately. Uh, yeah. So, we got a new visitor today. Don't say anything, but man, I'd love to be out there. What are you even wrenching? What are you even wrenching? There's not- that's a rivet. That's literally a rivet. Not immersive. Take your time. You should check it out. Got a lot to offer these days. Maybe someday. At the rate we're working these days, maybe sooner than later. Hope you guys get some breaks at least. You can't work all the time. Tell me about it. They say it's all the moving parts that have us working around the clock these days. Structurally, I guess 81 is still pretty sound. Vault Tech sure knew what they were doing when they set these places up. Well, I don't want to keep you, and I gotta get back to work. Maybe I'll see you around. <clears throat> Miranda likes to tell me that I'm just taking anyone for granted, but I can't help but feel trapped here sometimes. We got a barber here if you need it. Uh, not saying you do. Another outsider? What they let you in for? Just taking a look around. Is the overseer just letting anyone in these days? I'm a fellow vault dweller. I don't care where you're from. It's not here. What the? Not hiding this time! This is gonna be a big You know what? I think Cat did the same vault. She was getting ready for the end. Which, since I mentioned Cat, go subscribe to my Cat. gonna kill ashes <gasps> Kate terminal only anyway like it never even happened if sands were here he would know <clears throat> I don't want to talk. Your okay. lady friend looking for trouble? I feel like she's sizing me up. No signs of radio. <clears throat> you should stop by and see Horatio hey, while you're here. Gonna 
here. I can't imagine. You got guts wearing that tip for the Commonwealth. Ash! I can't believe someone Excuse me. Damn it. Steal it yet. Aaron's not going to like this. If you're looking to do some trading, look for the depot. Alexis has just about anything you could need. Yeah. <clears throat> now that you made it in, we'll be keeping an eye on you. So do us all a favor and behave yourself. I definitely didn't kill everybody and then like uh, so clean. What do you mean, Kate? from the Commonwealth? Me? No. I'm from the moon. Still got cheese on my shoes. I guess that was a dumb question. But I bet it's your first time here. I can show you around the vault if you want. Just five caps. Sure. But I'm not paying you. Okay, okay. Boy, you're a real cheapskate. We'll start over here. family run it. Aaron and I are best friends. Her mom and dad fight a lot, so I don't like to go in there when they're around. But if you need something, they're the ones that have it. You're right to avoid them. They sound like bad people. They're not so bad. They don't hit each other or anything. Next stop, the Overseer. I bet you killed a lot of strange things. Ooh, and raiders. I bet you fought Raiders, too. Okay. I'll stop. Oh, you said next stop, kid. Jesus. Really? Overseer's office is up there. They're busy up there, and they do not like to be bothered. She makes rules, but she's nice. I like her. What just flew down there? Never met a politician that wasn't corrupt. I'm not sure what you mean by corrupt, but she's not mean or anything. Next stop, the diner. Now we gotta go downstairs. That's where the diner is. Everybody eats there. Sometimes it gets real crowded. The summer sets are nice, though. You'll like them. Hello, Austin. I see you're showing our guests from the Commonwealth around. Yes, ma'am. This is the Sunshine Diner. Grant says that they'll take all of our hard work and turn it into swill. Mr. and Mrs. Somerset run the diner. They're pretty nice. Mrs. Somerset's pies are the best. I'll come here if I get hungry. I like it here. I'll save you a slice of pie, Austin. Next stop, Horatio. I told you they were nice. Do you like your hair? I like mine. I hate combing it, though. Grant makes me comb it. Where'd you get a glass? Oh. 
lost it. That hair of yours is a mole rat's nest. <laughs> this is where Horatio fixes up people's hair. Darren's mom comes here all the time. Gran hardly comes here at all. She makes me cut my hair, though. I almost my had it. Hair. Hey, where are you going? You only have what? Thanks, Horatio. I love it. I didn't think I'd ever make it in with the hours I've been working. Hey, Austin. Now Grant is a bottomless pit when it comes to Just food. remember, a couple months and you come back and see me. I can't uh, wait till I don't have to go to school anymore. Rest. No promises there, but I'll try. Hi, how are you? Ah, uh, I was hoping I could guess that's enough. This strain is doing quite well. <clears throat> Those seedlings are almost ready for transplant. Very little discoloration. Strong cellular plant structure. I'll have to see how it holds up to exposure. That's group A uh, A14-1. Week one. Week one examination. Gen uh, germination was fast. Seeds have sprouted and are healthy. Radicals and hip uh, hypocotyles appear strong. Initial examination of cells appears normal. A14-1.5 and A14-1.9 both display three cotyledons. A14-1.2 is displaying purple stripe pattern. Week 2 examination. Seedlings continue to grow normally and will uh, be ready for transplant. Roots appear healthy and are steadily growing. Items of note A14-1.5 and A14-1.9 despite their differences. A thriving well alongside the others. A14-1.2 has died. That section revealed little to differentiate it from the others. This coloration does not appear to be an infection or parasite. Week 3 of examination. All seedlings have been successfully transplanted. Growth continues to appear healthy. Water intake is normal. EO2. One examination, germination has been slow, only 50% of the seeds have sprouted. The radical is uh, barely showing. I have my doubts the other half, or on the other half. This group does not have a higher chance of failure. This group does have a higher chance of failure due to radiation exposure. The initial 50% of seeds initially sprouting have continued to show signs of growth. In addition, 25% have also started to sprout. I will continue to observe the remainder. I lost BO2-3.02, 3.05, 3 3.06, and 3.08 uh, to overwatering. These seedlings utilize far less water than previous hybrids. Potential benefit, but I'll need to monitor them closely for proper hydration. Translated BO2 3.01, 3.08, 3.10, 3.15. Uh, the others have not formed a strong enough root bed to safely move. No further seeds have sprouted since week two. Seeds. I need more seeds. Everything's under control. She's looking pretty bad in there. <clears throat> so, you're the new gal. I heard we let someone into the how long do you plan on sticking around? Long enough to have a good look around. Well, hopefully that means not long. We can take care of ourselves here in 81. We don't need to be letting in every stray traveler that comes our way. Okay. Forsyth is asking to see you. See me? Pardon me, officer. Dr. Forsyth and Rachel have plenty of medical supplies to get you stocked up. Sorry about the maintenance. It never ends these days. Watch out for the maintenance. It never ends. Need to check the water pump. Whoa! Again. A real funny. life Commonwealth person. You dress funny. Thanks. Please, you haven't needed my help in years. Whatever it is, they can wait. Oh, so Aaron and I can just wait? You're gone more than you're here. Will they take the goat? Hey, oh, you're that new traveler. You must have had so many adventures out in the Commonwealth. 
Every waking moment is an adventure out there. Oh my, I knew it. My kids would love to hear some of them. Would you be willing to talk to my class? I'd be glad to talk to him. Marvelous. Stop by whenever class is in session. I'll just stop what I'm doing and turn the class over to you. Hey, Katie. This will be a rare day indeed. I just hope the kids behave. I can't wait to see how excited the kids will be. Hello, Katie. The children will be very excited to hear about the Commonwealth. If you want a good meal, see Maria at the cafeteria. She'll hook you up. Defend County Crossing. Eh. Would you like to tell the students one of your stories now? I'd be glad to. Wonderful. The kids are so excited. Children! Children, listen up! We have a guest today who is going to tell us stories about the Commonwealth. Did you ever fight a death claw? I did. With nothing more than a pistol and three bullets. Really? A group of raiders had my friend Preston trapped. But you rescued him, right? Preston showed me where to find some power armor I could fix. Power armor! Wow. I wasn't ready when the Death Claw crawled out. Good thing I had that power armor. That sounds scary. Preston and I kept shooting until it was dead. I bet that took lots of bullets. Thank you so much for that story. Children, say thank you. Thank, thank you. you. And we have a thank you gift for you. Here. Oh yeah. Hey, fuck it, it's a side quest. Is it the I-O-N? Oh, but that's T-I-O-N. I'm in. Recession. By using this terminal, you are acknowledging that you are an authorized user or technician. Unauthorized users must cease reading and log out of this terminal immediately. Violators will be subject to civil and criminal penalties. Welcome to Vault 81. Overseer Olivet, we'd like to thank you for accepting your new role as Overseer of Vault 81. The program, as you know, represents a critical research opportunity to work. The work we do together will lead to a better future for humanity. Not only for these times of uncertainty, but for times far into the future, whatever it holds. Your background in academic and applied medical research will make a, you a capable leader to Vault 81, science staff. And your administrative uh, background gives you the unique ability to lead and manage the general population as well. Thank you again for reconsidering uh, this offer of employment and good luck, Vault Tech Human Resources. Prime Directive. The mission of Vault 81 is to research infectious disease and antibodies. With particular attention to paid, uh, paid to potential mutations in the 
a climate of heavy radiation. Clinical trials are a vital part of Vault 81's mission. Trials will be performed in three stages. Stage 1 uh, trials are to be conducted in a petri dish cultures. Stage 2 trials are to be performed on the colony of <coughs> heterocephalus glabber specimens finished by Vault Tech or furnished by Vault Tech. Stage 3 trials may be performed on the residential population of Vault 81. Scientific staff will be restricted to hermetically sealed research area. This measure reduces the chance of cross-contamination between residential and scientific staff populations. The overseer will have communication capabilities, but no other members of the residential population are to be made aware of the prime directive. Mission Protocol As outlined in the vault Tech Operation Handbook, all staff members of Vault 81 will be required to participate in mandatory drills held on site at the discretion of the overseer and vault Tech administration. Admission drills are a requirement on all beta alert days, as indicated by the Vault Tech early warning system. In the event of an actual alpha alert, Vault 81 residents will be admitted into Vault by overseer staff. All scientific staff should be or should report to their workstations immediately, avoiding contact with general population, especially those whom they may know personally. If necessary, overseers should remind staff of their confidentiality status. All residents should be admitted in an orderly fashion and given the approved welcome address in the common area atrium by overseer. The overseer should then use this terminal to confer privately with the head of the science staff, by now safely sealed in the research area. Evacuation Protocol <clears throat> Vault 81 is not to be evacuated under any circumstances except direct all clear command from Vault Tech Central HQ. Research reports uh, should be archived on the primary mainframe. Chemical compounds uh, and other physical materials may be deposited in the marked receptacle only by the overseer and only after successful stage 3 trial phase. In the event of a Vault Tech ordered evacuation, overseer must be prepared to dispose of residential population by incineration. Repellent nozzles are pre-installed in the all residential living quarters to avoid contamination with the outside population. This disposal is at the discretion of the overseer unless specifically mandated as part of Vault Tech evacuation order. Damn! So they were using them as human clinical trials for viruses and then just said, yo, if we have to evacuate, you burn them alive. That's, oh, that's intense. <clears throat> Overseer's private logs. A job's a job. Can't believe it. Vault Tech must really have been desperate for an Overseer candidate after Duncan fell ill. I'm certainly qualified for this job. But with my politics, how could they think I'm a good candidate for this kind of program? Maybe there's more to this than I'm seeing. They still haven't given me a full briefing on the work we'll be doing here, but I'm not stupid. I'm pretty sure it's going to involve human trials. I won't jump to any conclusions, though. Let's see how this plays out. If they're crossing any ethical lines with me, they'll be in a congressional hearing before they know what's hit them. Drills, drills, drills. These researchers are willing to put up with a lot. Today is our fifth drill of the week, and this time I had to make the calls in the middle of the night after these scientists are just kids between cramming for finals and sleeping off Friday hangovers. I'm shocked as many of them staggered in as did. I guess the pay is worth it. I know I wasn't earning the kind of money as a grad student. Much worse than I thought. I was finally given the full briefing today. Not only is the Vault Tech asking us to do clinical trials on humans, they've got some serious backers in the government. I can't just blow the whistle on this. I've uh, seen the admission roster. There are good people planning to live in Vault 81, and I have little doubt the vaults will come into the use eventually. I won't reward the trust of these people by threatening, well, unlike guinea pigs. I feel trapped, I don't know what to do. 
the day. It's done. I got the call early this morning. Another beta drill. It's always Rosaria who has the call. Her voice was trembling and she couldn't get off the phone soon enough. She knew, sure enough, the warnings was upgraded within a few hours and the news reporting confirmed launches soon after that. I made a decision. I deliberately sabotaged the phone list. Such a simple thing, but it meant that none of the science staff received a notification about the drill. The residents are beginning to show up and we'll have our hands busy admitting everyone. Science staff. I'm no criminal mastermind. Clearing the phone list prevented most of the scientists' staff from showing up. But these still made, uh, the three still made it in. Flint and Collins are both my age. I live in Fens. They had time to get here with general population. Burrow is just an overreacher or over overachiever. He came in by the morning or by in came by in the morning just to see if there'd be a drill today. Figures. They reported uh, to the research area that vault tech protocols engaged automatically and sealed them in. They're already busy with their work, especially since there are only three of them. They suspect Burrow and Flint are getting restless in there. Collins and that robot, he's calling her Curry now. Keeping the mood relatively steady. But I think they already suspect that I have no intention of allowing them to implement the stage 3 trial. Not sure what to do. They've got access to the delivery nozzles. If they choose to, they'll be able to infect the population with whatever they want. Need to keep them calm. Forgiveness. I made a grim choice. I sabotaged the delivery nozzles in all the residents' quarters as soon as I was able. To. I didn't expect Burrow to notice so soon. Hell, I didn't expect Collins to get so close to phase three trial so quickly. I didn't expect half of what's happened in the past few months. Cutting off communication is a cowardly thing to do. What options do I have? I have food and water in there as long as they need. I just can't let them go through with human trials for God knows what fault tech plans to do with their research. I only know that somehow they can forgive me. Hope and live out their years of peace over there. Research comrade records. Jesus! Testing one, two, three. K Collins, testing. Dr. Olivia, do you copy? Oh, Olivia, I do, Kenneth. Everything good over there? K Collins, just another drill day, right, Overseer? It is. Thank God for that. Overseer, uh, there are just three of us over here. What's going on? Olivia, are you getting these? Sorry, Kevin, it's been a madhouse on this side. Only three? Myself, Jim Flint, and that, ki and that kid, Burrow. Uh, where is everyone else? Olivia. Not over here. Residents are being admitted. They started showing up in droves once the news started broadcasting. That's the same way I heard. You think Vault Tech uh, would have had enough warning to call at least the beta drill for staff this morning? Something must have gone wrong. Phone one, phase one trial. Hey, cons, we've been pretty limited down here, but we've been focused on antibiotics and have our first Petri trials underway. Saw the data last night. It's promising, but do you think it's ready? The trials just started, and the virus we're going after uh, has a few days of uh, inoculation, but I'm optimistic that later this week we'll see positive results. Okay, keep me posted, and don't begin phase two of the trials until I have the opportunity to go through the new data. Of course, have a good afternoon, Overseer. Food extruder issue. Emperor Overseer, do you have a minute? This system is an instantaneous burrow. I hope they haven't been waiting too long or wait for a reply all morning. Sorry, Overseer. I wanted to notify you about an issue with our food extruder. Okay, I see it now. It looks like a clog in the pro uh, protein tank. You weren't able to address it on your end? No, Overseer. Hardware failures on the residential side must be addressed over there. We can't get to the tanks or nozzles to repair them. Okay, Burrow, I'll have the maintenance down here immediately. Go stand by and have Collins contact me if there's still issues in about 10 minutes, okay? Thank you, Overseer. I'll go there now. Phase 2. <coughs> Took allergy meds this morning, too. Nothing there, I'm just clogging up. Good news, Dr. Olivet. 
We've tweaked our formula based on phase one trial results, and I think we're ready to go with phase two. How's the mole rat population doing? Very well. The specimens vault tech provided are remarkably hard. Flint uh, has been doing some radiation testing on them. Is that the protocols? Not technically, but we noticed some weird stuff what the kibble provided for them. Uh, Burrow got pretty sick for a day or two. Don't ask. Plus, we're looking into it. These suckers are big to begin with. And we're thinking it's genetic. Tampered with? Something like that. I think Vault Tech must have been running some experiments with them. They're all unusually large. A few demonstrate bi uh, bioluminescence. At least one appears more intelligent than normal. Do you think they're still useful control? We decided the colony separated the most unusual specimens and put the control colony on the new diet taken from our own food supply. Not ideal, but I think we're okay. Very well, give me the evening to go over your data again, but I think you're clear to be in phase two unless I find anything I don't expect. <laughs> Overseer? Yes, bro, what is it? I've noticed an issue with our delivery mechanisms. Do you uh, know if anyone tampered with the nozzles in the residential quarters on your side? I don't know what, it, what, I don't know, what are you doing with the delivery system anyway? The phase two trial just began. I know, Overseer, I just thought it would be a good idea to run tests on the delivery system before we reached phase three. If we reach phase three, human trials are not to be undertaken lightly. What kind of tests were you hoping to run anyway? This is placebo vapor to make sure the nozzles are dispensing mist properly. The residents wouldn't even know they had done anything. I guess that's the idea, though. I'll look into the nozzle issue on my end, Burrow. In the meantime, please do not use the delivery system without my direct approval. Doctor, please get in touch. I know what you've done. Honestly, I don't blame you. Performing the phase three trial on, on non-consenting humans is a breach of ethics, at least according to the world we used to live in. I can keep Burrow together for a while, but Flint's already suspicious. What are we supposed to do over here? I can only lie to them for so long without actual response from you. Damn it, Olivia. You can't be such a hypocrite that you condemn us to die in the same name of your personal sense of morality. I know your politics, but I never thought you'd actually leave me men for dead. Please reconsider this. Old, old overseer got, uh... Old feet didn't want a human experiment. I don't blame her. Please direct any maintenance requests to Mr. T so you are programmed for vault maintenance? An astute observation. I assist Mr. DeLuca with reactor maintenance, tending to the heart of the vault. He prefers to supervise while giving me the privilege of fulfilling the tasks. Sounds like a typical boss to me. It's a relief to hear you say so. Compared to his predecessor, Mr. DeLuca has very little mechanical knowledge. I almost thought him unqualified. But when it comes to delegation, he's top notch. Hey, the outsider. You lost? trading going on down here I'm not lost oh well uh, welcome to the generator room I guess oh and hey if you got any jet on you I may be willing to take it off your hands say 75 caps who's it for you me myself and I don't worry I'm not into selling that's my sister's thing Sure. Here you go. Hell yeah. Thanks, man. Just don't let Tina know. She'd be all over my Tina's head. sitting right there. Excuse me. Hey, outsider. Do me a favor. If my good for nothing brother asks you for time. Mm -hmm. I already did. Damn it. Look, he's a junkie, but he's getting careless. If he gets caught, we're both in trouble. And as much as I'd like to leave this canned paradise, that's not how I want to go. Sounds like your problem, not mine. Now I admit, I've got my own share of the blame here. Bobby gets his chems from me, and I keep him on a short leash. 
But not anymore. I'm cutting off his useless ass. Good. That's the first step to helping your brother. Should have done it a long time ago. But things ain't easy around here. Sick. Work is this day almost over. Hey, I just literally gave you an upper, so like, shut up. Big vault. Sounds like they were, uh, well, they were kind of in trouble at the Cambridge Police Station. They were in pretty bad shape. Though. But they gave him a hand. Or a gun. Or some, the vault dweller helped them. They get a giddy up buttercup. I guess they made him back then. Arlen's old. Katie Pinn is a teacher here in 81. You should stop by her class. She's big on learning from outsiders. I already did. I wouldn't give for some real time off. Whatever you want, forget it. I can't be bothered with it right now. Yeah. I love the ambient amb ambient ambient music in here. Down in the medical center. They can patch you up. Oh, can I see the hazels in here? Welcome. I hope I'm not being presumptuous. But I'd like to ask you a favor. Sure. Do you mind donating some medical samples? Even just a blood sample. Am I for some caps? All right. The overseer did give me a few caps for this. How does 50 caps sound? Sure. You can have some blood. Excellent. Just have a seat, and I'll draw some blood. This will only take a sec. Uh they heard a bit, eh? Here are the caps I promised you. Thank you. This will be a great help. Now, I need to get these prepared immediately. You know that wanderer from the Commonwealth. I'm Rachel. I assist Dr. Forsyth with his medical. Rachel! Are you sick or injured? Could use some supplies, actually. Great. Let's take a look. Oh yeah, I could buy all the stim packs because I totally need them. Uh... Hello, Doctor Forsyth. Do you need something? I'm rather busy at the moment. Damn. Over, I guess I'll find the overseer. We got a barber here if you need it. Uh, not sorry. Poor Erin. Her cat got loose in the Commonwealth. I'll be damned if that whole duck is Watch out for the masons. It never ends well. But I wouldn't give for some brand spanking new genuine vault tech parts right now. Stay safe, man. Oh god. The new Vegas where you send all the ghouls to space. That's it. 
Supply requests. Maria Somerset fulfilled. Uh, Mutt fruit cakes three. Brahmin steaks ten. Jacob Forsyth fulfilled. Ten, Fifty stiff packs. Ten blood packs. Priscilla Pensky fulfilled. Three fusion cores. Maintenance request. Second floor atrium vent. Vent has been leaking. Need to investigate shaft for integrity. May need to replace bad section, but hopefully can get with the past job. Main level entrance. Pipes are suffering from corrosion. Need welding and sealant sections. Uh, flooring may need to be replaced. We'll need to take a closer look behind uh, the scenes to investigate the extent of damage. Entry. Sealant must be given away for concrete base as the water is building up among wiring on the floor. Need a solution for resealing and water removal. Logs. Repairs, repairs, repairs. If one more thing in this vault breaks, I'm going to scream, and by scream, I mean angrily slam the keys of the, uh, uh, to this terminal. I, I mean, uh, as I, I enter in yet another frustrated log, no one told me when I took over as Overseer Bot, or for Overseer Bot, that I was inheriting a sinking ship. From what Calvin tells me, the damage isn't even coming from us in our everyday lives. It's something external, and of course, since it's external, it's harder for him to assess the overall damage. We can't very well just unburden the vault. On the good side, uh, the reactors continue to run without a hitch. Two centuries and not a single incident that old Rusty couldn't handle. So while the walls around us crumble, at least we'll have good lighting. Something, yeah. The Antique Commonwealth. Once again, I overheard a citizen telling one of the traders how much we don't need them. What is wrong with these people? Holt, Miranda, don't they realize that without the traders we'd be starving? We would have half the items needed to get uh, repairs done around here. I get the fear to allow outsiders in. I was terrified when we first opened the vault after two centuries of isolation, but you'd think after ten years people would be more accepting and trust the, face, uh, the faces we've grown to know so well. Some people uh, still don't accept her, uh, Horatio, the man that lived, lived with us for year na years now. And sure, I don't know what could happen in the future. Maybe it's just a matter of time before we allow the wrong person in. But that's not a chance. It, it's a chance that we uh, have to take to change. Uh, they need to accept if we're going to survive for another generation. Bobby DeLuca. How hard can it be to catch Bobby DeLuca doing drugs? The vault is only so big. There's only so many places he can hide. Yet yeah, here I am getting another complaint about his little habit. It's frustrating on so many levels. Everyone's working hard almost around the clock, and here's Bobby. He sleeps on the job, a job that he can't even do, by the way. He gets old Rusty to do everything. He's not high, he's drunk. His sister backs up every story he comes up with. The list goes on. Part of me just wants to lock him up, post a guard, and be done with it. Let him suffer through the withdrawal as, as his punishment. We all know he deserves it. Yeah, I definitely didn't give him drugs. Food, glorious food. Priscilla informed me that she lost the latest carrot crop. I wish we had the space to do more uh, consistent rotations. On the bright side, while we'll miss the carrots now, we'll be even happier once they're back. I'll never forget the day Maria made her first Brahmin meat pie. I thought I was in heaven, and that I'd never eat another steak in a box again. Against Dr. Forsyth's wishes, I might add wasn't long before I had uh, my fill and found myself enjoying the same old Salisbury steak. On the bright side, Maria's mud fruit pies are consistently good, although it's hard to go wrong when it comes to dessert. It helps that she likes to save them for special occasions, probably smart on her part. She's uh, been our chef long enough to know how easily our taste buds give out on us. Make that thing pour you a drink and I'll be impressed. And no one's here watching me. Is this her bathroom? Wow, she gets a nice shower. Oh, look at you with the uppers. Officer. Don't want any trouble in 81. Uh, I think nice I'm done boy. here. 
it ever starts acting up on you, see Alexis. She'll fix it right up. Yeah, I don't know. I go up, I guess. But how? Cat managed to get out of the vault. Can't imagine he'll live too long out there in the Commonwealth. You're that Commonwealth traveler, aren't you? Hi, how are you? Ash ran out the door. I was expecting this place. Gotta find the terminal. Just as a stim pack can be used to revive fallen human or canine companion during combat, repair kit can be used to repair a damaged robot. No way. I see something that's not discovered directly in front of me. Not Hill Reservoir. Probably. Yeah, whatever. I literally don't need to. I wonder. Oh yeah, we have over we have over a thousand ten millimeter rounds. We have eight hundred and sixty nine forty four rounds. So I have over a thousand fifty cal rounds, and I still have seventeen hundred fucking forty five rounds. I'm good. I'm good. Even if I went to Nuka World right now, I'm good. Same with Far Harbor. What is this? Oh. Zelda. Huh? To not be put on camera anymore? Huh? To be not put on camera anymore? Huh? Bongo 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 something something dumb to jungle da 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 Bingo, bango, bongo. Do I have time for two videos today? No, unless I cut them short. I ain't gonna do that. I'll take the time to relax and do something before work. <sighs>
there's a spot. spot first. I'm gonna go there. I'll walk back to that little trailer area. Close to that. Greater Mass Blood Clinic. I wonder if there's blood bugs here. If an assault rifle shoots five five six. Boston Mayoral Shelter. The ghouls here. Wires mm, key. Right. Right. We should get out of here. Oh, we ain't going anywhere. Yeah. 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 Yeah
sweeping the floor with you. How people died there. What are these? See them every now and again, but I don't know what they are. Uh, skate. Come on, you're wasting your time in that thing. Hey, it's free experience, Kate. All right. What I'm here for? Free experience. There's gas in this room. Gas in this whole area. the sense see Kate oh perfect the fusion core Time to go find those synths. I like how that Deathclaw thought he had a chance. I don't even know where I am. I'm just eliminating everyone. Master terminal. Uh, ING. There we go. Am 
Might as well take it right away, I guess. I only have 87 of them, though. Oh, wow, stim packs. You know, I want to save those stim packs. I better just sleep in this bed. Oh, we perfect. much more than that. Did he die in the tub? Yep. Hi, sweetheart. I'm sorry it had to end this way. I tried to build a place where our children could live comfortably. You know, I'm a family man. And no, our children come first. I'd do anything for them. Even at the expense of taxpayers' money. The mob has broken through. And it's only a matter of time before they reach the lower level. As a last resort to protect our family, I give you... Well, I... I give you myself. Take my body to the people. Tell them Sweet. I died a coward. Maybe they will leave you in peace. Oh, wow. I left the key to the safe with one of the attendants. I, I forget his name. Anyway, goodbye, my darling. I love you Hello? and the children so much.
Got it. Uh, it's totally gonna help. How much rad X I have, along with my hazmat suit. Oh yeah, rad away! Your target has not disappeared. Your target's just very dangerous. Is there a door in here that I missed? I am equipped with the most advanced institute sensors available. There's one. That's it, there's not another door. Where's that synth hiding? Yeah, where are you? Oh, whatever, let's get out of here. I don't know where that last synth fuck is. Sense never stood a chance. Oh, God damn it. These random fucking radiation storms, man. satellite array.
Oh, there's nothing in there. Relay Tower, 0BB-915. Oh, the distress signal. Fort Hagen filling station. I suppose that's something worth building, whatever it is. Ooh, I have fallen asleep. someone present yeah probably nice there we go we got double damage on non-automatic pistols. Movement detected. Curious. Movement detected. Curious. Are you attempting an ambush? Hello. Attacking an enemy. <laughs>
gonna have to send a course here to fuck with me. Got the turbo pump bandings or bearings. The tens. Yes. Success. You eliminating hostile? Are you sure? How sure are you? You must be terrified. See where it wants me to go. How do I get lower?
I do not know how to get down there. Whatsoever. Go back up. Then we're gonna find the stairs again. That was a waste of time. For this episode where nothing happened. Went through Vault 88, kinda. I'm, I'm sure we left some quests sitting there. Uh, now, we're gonna finally finish this USS Constitution fucking quest. Anyway, one day, 17 hours in, still doing nothing. We're gonna do something eventually. Hope you enjoyed. If you like this content, hit feel free to subscribe. If you like the video, like the video. <clears throat> <coughs> Till next time.